How to get and use the net projectile. In Genesis part 2, you can unlock the net projectile if you are level 43. Then you can craft it in your inventory. In order to use the net projectile, you need a harpoon launcher. And the engram for that can be learned at the same level, 43. The harpoon is crafted in a smithy. Even though harpoon is made for underwater, the net doesn't work there. If you load a net projectile to your harpoon, you cannot use it underwater. But you can shoot from above and trap the dinos that is in the water. Now the net projectile nets a dino for one full minute. And after that time passes, the dino gets a 10 seconds resistance. You can't trap it again within that resistance timer. After that, you can net it again. What net projectile can trap requires some testing. But I will start with what the net projectile cannot trap. So, the large creatures like Gigas, Rexes, Spinos, Reapers, Racers, Rontos, Diplos cannot be trapped. Most likely, anything that is smaller than these creatures can be trapped with a net projectile. Now, let me show you what you can trap with a net projectile. A Yuri. These guys are one of the hardest creatures to trap because they fear most of the dinos. But now, you can trap them with a net projectile and build the trap around them you got one minute to work with a quetzal yes you can net the flyers as well rg snow owl whatever all works just be careful not to knock out the quetzal above water if you make that mistake you should know that you can fish them out with a horse and a lasso check the cards right now if you want to see more of this and know how it works a mana garmir yes manas are pretty large but they cannot get out of the net project also a rock drake you can net projectile a rock drake well we can't tame them but it could be useful when you are trying to get one of their eggs you can just trap them and run away and also wyverns the smaller crystal wyverns can be trapped but the original old wyverns that is larger cannot be trapped with a net projectile also it doesn't work on zombie wyverns and the dinos i think it will be useful to net projectile while you are out taming them terries tylas bears perlovias and kangaroos all the medium-sized dinos that you cannot pick up with rgs or the ones that jump on you this net projectile will be very good for to tame them all and also a mammoth these guys are also huge but the net projectile gets them no matter what and there is something else about mammoths for some weird reason if you get feared by mammoths ability you cannot net anything like until the debuff wears off you cannot trap any dino it just doesn't work it feels like a bug to be honest because it lowers your damage the debuff but net actually doesn't do any damage it just does one damage so maybe it lowers to the zero or something like that and make it useless i don't know we'll see later on now here comes the trouble here is the huge problem about net projectiles this is for pvp players the net projectile can trap tame dinos and enemy dinos when that happens you can't ride the dino you can't remove the net projectile now you know how stego is insane these days well it is not any more. if they keep this for enemy dinos medium sized soakers are pretty much done you can just net them and kill them And that goes for anything that can be trapped with the net. You don't need to plant Z, the mana guy anymore. Just shoot it with a net. It's over for a minute. Done. Cannot move. Some guy is trying to end you with a blood stalker. No worries. Just net them. That stalker is done. Useless. Alright, before this video ends, I'm gonna show you a bug I discovered. You can net and bola small creatures. But if the bola wears off, the dino can move while it's net it pretty weird right and it will be also weird if you watch this video until the end and leave without liking just kidding it won't be weird that's why thank you for watching dear watchers see you on the next video about genesis part 2